Hi there, this is Simon from writtenlegalenglish.com and welcome to another video where we're going to have a look at some overly complex text and redraft it into plainer but yet still professional English. Well, at least you're going to try and do that. This week we are still looking at the text that you can find on a bank's website. It's a different bank this week, but nevertheless I found some pretty complicated text for you to think about and redraft into a plainer but yet professional way. So let's get started. But just before we get started, I just want to remind you guys about the content that I put out every single week on LinkedIn, YouTube, Facebook, and on Patreon. On Tuesday, I put out this video, giving you some sentences for you to think about how you would redraft that in a plainer but yet professional way. On Wednesday, I put out videos from my online course, helping you to develop your professional English writing skills. These are just very short videos which concentrate on one particular point, and if you just include that, uh, that teaching point into your writing, you will already be improving your writing skills. And on, then on Friday, at the end of the week, I give you how I would redraft the sentences that I asked you to think about on Tuesday. Okay, so now you know about all of the videos that I produce, let's have a look at the sentences I want you to think about this week. Now, as I said, this comes from a bank's website, not the same bank as last week, and this comes from the terms and conditions of uh, how you send data to the bank. And as I was reading through these terms and conditions, I found these two sentences, which I really think should be redrafted in a better way. First one, data retention period. Your personal data will be retained no longer than until you withdraw your consent. There must be an easier way to say that. So think about what the main message is. Think about how you can make it simple. And if it's necessary to remove unnecessary text, then please go ahead and do so. And then the second text, I give my consent to be contacted by phone by the bank for the purpose of presenting marketing information in telephone conversations. Yep. That is a mouthful to say, it's a nightmare to read, so how would you improve that text? Have a think about it, and then come back at the end of the week, either catch me on Facebook, LinkedIn, YouTube, or on Patreon, and see what, see how I would redraft those sentences. I'll see you then.